There's a second DiBiase. Do they have the chase? Oh my gracious in heaven, Brad. What is good, everybody? Welcome back to another My Am Toys video. Today, we're back with a brand new WWE action figure toy hunt. Going to be hitting up some stores today. And it's actually an out-of-town toy hunt. So if you guys missed our big unboxing from yesterday, doesn't look like a lot of people saw that one. You definitely need to go check that one out. We got a big box of stuff. Actually, like four different packages. It was a classic My Damn Halls episode without the trusty knife. So you got to go over there and find out about that. But today, we are back with a brand new WWE action figure toy hunt that is out of town, man. So I'm actually going out of town for a tattoo. And I'm excited to do so, man. It's going to be a John Cena themed tattoo so that should be really fun but we are going out of town for the toy hunt and I figured you know why not throw in some stops you got to stop along the way see because you don't always get the opportunities to hit these stores man so when you have an opportunity you're going out of town I don't know if I'm the only one but I like to take advantage of that because you get to go to stores that you don't normally go to and that's the way it goes you, you guys can also see the work that we're doing here in the office you got the accent wall looking pretty decent over here the the stripes are not completely done but we're working on it little by little patron members of course are seeing that early and all those different things over there but let's shut the hell up let's dive into it let's get in the car and let's go see our first stop and see if we can find some good stuff of course always on the hunt for new figures i am looking for the new legends figures lots of clearance items right now so i mean hey we may cash in our money in the bank briefcase but let, nonetheless man let's shut the hell up let's get into what the hell we got to get into and see you guys on the hunt all right brother we're in a underground target anybody got an underground target at their place we're literally under the ground right now so i'm actually in the atlanta area right now so if you're in the atlanta area maybe you've hit this target before but Yo, we're underground, baby. Let's see what they got. Maybe they got some good stuff. Let's find out. That's a big-ass target. All right, guys, here we go. Out of town. Where's the WWE? Oh, snap. Here is Adam Cole. I don't know. It says clearance, but I don't know if this is actual clearance or it's just got stuck here. But I already have this. I don't have it loose, though. That might be a, that might be a cop. We'll see about that. But, uh, okay, here we go. Oh, snap. We got some new stuff. Greatest Hits, Shawn Michaels. I haven't seen this in person yet. I haven't seen any of the Greatest Hits figures. Oh my God, DDP. Very nice. Triple H. And what's badass about this is this is the new Legends wave, man. Look, Triple H, Ted DiBiase, Mr. Perfect, and Great Hammer Valentine. But do they have any more of the set? That's going to be the real kicker. This is arguably the worst figure in the set. But I'm probably going to be copying both of these. We also have Brother Love over here. We got Greatest Hits, DDP. Got Mustafa here, six six dollars. I mean, pretty pretty good. If you want to cash in your money in the bank contract, we got Trent. We got Cash Wheeler, Unrivaled Twelve. We got Rip Stereo Greatest Tip. Oh, it's a Top Picks version, so it does have the double joint. Okay, so that, that's my first time seeing these as well. We have Greatest Hits Taker, very nice right there. Another Greatest Hits Taker. We have a Legends Taker. We have another Sean. We have the Chase D'Lo Brown. We got more legends up here. Okay, Dax. We got Britt Baker. Britt Baker. We got Britt Baker again. I don't think either of these have been chased. That's unmatched series one. These have been here forever. We have just a, just a slew of Mustafa. Just a ton of Mustafa going on. We got Zeus over here. Pretty cool figure. I feel like this one shell forms a lot for some reason. We have Brother Love, Brother Love, Brother Love. Bianca, Bianca. We have Jesus Christ, we have a wild Lacey Evans, we got uh, Candice LeBray, we got Trash Corbin in the brown, and then we have Trash Corbin again, and then we have Taker, 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 and I mean, I believe that is it, I'm not seeing anything else at this juncture, I mean, uh, I'm, that's pretty crazy though, seeing the greatest hits figures is pretty cool. Triple H and Shawn Michaels are probably a cop, and I feel like I need to get at least one of these. How much is the Dilo Brown? The Dilo Brown, is it on clearance? I think it says it's... I can't tell. And what figures is this talking about? Is that going to include the greatest hits? Are the greatest hits 15 bucks? Or, okay, Dilo's 11. Uh, Brother Love is 6. Like, Jesus, man. Okay, hopefully... Hopefully the 1539 does include the greatest hits figures. But D'Lo Brown for Chase D'Lo Brown for eleven bucks might be also a move, but six dollar Mustafa. I mean, how do you not cash in, man? How do you not go ahead and grab that? But I do want to look around a little bit to see if they actually have anything else that we're looking for. You know, clearance and whatnot. I'm gonna see if there's a clearance section, and I'll update you guys. Okay, so update. I can't find any clearance 
I do not see any clearance. However, we do have some new more religions in here. Uh, these are the ones that I was looking for. Remember when I said I wanted to wait till these hit clearance? Well, some of these did hit clearance, but these do not look to be on clearance, even though at my target they were on clearance. But I would definitely be grabbing that if it were on clearance. Don't really want to pay full price. Uh, so look right here. These at my target they had a ton of these, and then they put the rest of them on clearance and everybody cleared them out. I guess I'm going to scan this and see if this is on clearance and if it is i'll probably cop this as well but if not we'll just have to build a bridge take the l and then live with our mistakes i guess but let's go ahead and see what we can find here all right location number two we're hitting another target trying to find that damn rock figure brad trying to find the rock we're over one going to the second location let's see what we got all right man so i'm actually having to voice over this clip because this this target for whatever reason had the music blaring crazy loud so i'm gonna have to adjust the volume and then i'm just gonna voice over this part but they really didn't have much of stuff going on here you had a lot of brother love you had undertaker dingo warrior Rey mysterio lots of the same stuff going on with the legends man i mean it, this line's so great but you know they they definitely go on clearance really fast and i don't know why they do that but you know you can get some great deals i mean you can get figures for six bucks ten bucks which is fantastic for us collectors correct but you know, you hate to see him in that shape. This place did have a Hulk Hogan, though. Thought about copping that. Um, this Adam Cole looked funny because his head was forward. You had Corazon de Leon, Rey Mysterio. We had more Adam Cole, more of the Legends figures. And then we also had one Ultimate, which was going to be a Jeff Hardy figure. So I walked up into the section, started filming, and then the music was blaring so loud. And I was like, screw it. I'm just going to voice over this clip. So I do apologize for that. But I uh, still wanted to get on here and talk about it. But, yeah, man, the, they were blaring music here. So I'm just going to adjust the volume and move on. Third location is Target. You know what they say. They do say the third time's the charm. Will that be true, Brad? We won't know unless we go in. A little cloudy. What the hell is that? Nonetheless, let's go in here and see what the hell they got. Now, I'm pretty sure this is the same Target that we found the Batista at a long time ago on the channel. If you guys remember that toy hunt, or maybe I didn't even do a toy hunt. Maybe I just went and did it by myself. But I could have swore I filmed it. And if I didn't film it, I put it on Instagram. But nonetheless... Uh, we have good luck here. I think we're batting a thousand. Let's see if we can keep it up. All right, fellas, here we go. Oh, snap. We got some new legends in the house. We got Ted DiBiase. First time seeing this. Got the old man Ted head sculpt. All right, we already have Triple H. Now we have Ted DiBiase. There's a second DiBiase. Do they have the chase? Oh, my gracious in heaven, Brad. They do have the chase. So we got the white suit and the green suit. Looking pretty damn good right there. There we go. All right. And then here is Greg. So we got Greg. Greg the Hammer Valentine. Got that new thigh mold in there. Looking pretty good. Got the jacket. They're blaring the damn music in here. I'm going to have to keep talking so it doesn't get flagged. And then there's the last one. We got Mr. Perfect. So yellow singlet. Got the towel. That's the full set now. We have the full set. All right. So we have all five figures that we need, including Triple H. I did grab the Triple H, and they actually don't have the Triple H here. So now we have the complete set. Now, another thing I saw was the Legend Cage right here. The classic cage play set. I don't think I'm going to buy this, but it's still really cool for displays and stuff like that. First time. I think this is actually the second time I'm seeing this in person, but I didn't really register that I saw this last time we were on Toy Hunt. So there is that. We got Ortiz and a J and a J. Got Stu Grayson. Got a couple Adam Coles back here, it looks like. Got some basics, you know, kind of older now. Old Sasha. We got The Rock, WrestleMania. We do have Isaiah Cassidy. And it looks like, yeah, we have the tag team. We have Mark Quinn and Isaiah Cassidy. So, we have both of those, which is nice. And then, what else we got? Got the uh, top picks, Rey Mysterio with the double jointed arms. We have Greg again. We have the Ultimate Warrior. We have Sean, and we have Sean again. A few Samoa Joes in there, looking good. A lot of Samoa Joes, three of those. Archer, Archer, Dax, and Thunder Rosa. No chase, but I'm definitely going to be securing all four of these guys. Probably need to grab those right now before we walk off, but uh, I only have one arm, so it's going to make toy hunting the rest of the time a little bit difficult, but I'm not going to put these down, Brad. Not not a chance, so you never know what you're going to you know lose if you put something down, but let's keep walking around here. They also have the forklift stuff. And then uh, I think that's it for this section, but we can move around. All right, so they have some Dingo Warriors here, 50% off, $7.99. Not bad, but I already have two or three of them, I think, so I'm not going to be doing that. Looks like they do have the Scroll 2-pack, and they also have the Target Exclusive Black Widow, which I think I'm going to have to purchase that. I'm going to check the price on that, but 
Dingo Warrior is a no-go for me, but I'm not seeing anything else here. I'm gonna keep searching though. We're still on the hunt here. Gotta keep keep looking. I'll let you guys know about clearance. All right, so on this end cap, they have clearance and then they have just a bunch of Adam Coles, D'Lo Brown, Brother Love, and Kamala or Mustafa, whatever you wanna say there. And then we have an Ultimate Edition, Alexa Bliss. And we have Elite 92, we have Raquel, Elite 93, and then we have Scarlet Elite 92 with another Adam Cole. The Adam Coles are $9.99 here. At the first Target, though, they were $5.99, and I actually grabbed it at that Target because they're cheaper. But here's a side shot of everything. Nothing too crazy, but I think that is it for here. But uh, I think we're on to the next one. Or I don't even know. This may be the last play. I don't know. Let's, let's keep rolling. All right, brethren, we are back home after our toy hunt and this is an immaculate day i thought it was a damn good day man really excited to dive into everything that we got here of course this is our damn halls right here man look at all these halls we got right here not to mention we have this dan house and then we have all of these figures here man so let's just go ahead and dive into what we got very success i'm so excited with what we had today man because we got a lot of deals a lot of stuff was on clearance so let's dive into it man the first figure that we did get is the wwe elite greatest at Shawn Michaels. I do own this figure already, but you guys know I love this head sculpt, and I wanted to take advantage of that. You don't get a, you know, this first time seeing this at retail, wanted to grab this one, so we did get the Shawn, and I want to say this was like 15 bucks instead of the full price, so we're always excited for that, man. You always love to see a, a you know, a half-priced item or an item that's on clearance, so we did pick up another Shawn Michaels figure. We also got all four of the new legends, or all five, I should say, because we also got the chase. But the first one is the Triple H. Not the most exciting figure of all time, but, you know, it is a Triple H figure. We do have the cloth goods in there. You know, it's looking all right. It's kind of a repeat, but we do have double jointed arms and things of that nature. But we are going to review this entire Legends wave. We also got the Chase D-Lo. Now, this is my second Chase D-Lo, so I'll probably be giving this away to my patron members. I think this is a really cool figure, though, and uh, I think this is going to be a patron giveaway. I don't know if this will be September or October's giveaway, but we do have a Chase D-Lo Brown, so this will be up for grabs probably on Patreon either this month or next month. Haven't quite decided. been going back and forth with a couple figures, but I figured this could be a good patron prize. We also have the Target exclusive Black Widow. Now, this is, I think, regular, what, $30 or something like that? It was on sale for $12, $13, $13, and I was really happy with this, man. I, I'm so excited to crack this out of the packaging. It was torn on the side right here. But, uh, I mean, I guess it's possible that I open this up and it's not the Black Widow, but hopefully it will be the Black Widow. But really excited for this, this new body mold and all these different textures and the posability of this figure. Looks incredible. Really excited to uh, crack Black Widow out of the packaging and, and get that figure in our hands. We also have the Target exclusive Adam Cole. Now, this is the second figure of this, but I'm going to actually open this one up because, uh, oh, okay, so it doesn't. Okay, I thought it had the clearance sticker on there. But the packaging isn't in perfect shape. I guess I'll just compare it to my other one, and then we'll decide which packaging is worse, and then you, you know what I'm saying. We'll, we'll compare packaging. Whichever one sucks, we'll throw that one in the yard, and then we'll open the other one. You, you get the whole point there. We also have the rest of the Legends figures, which I'm so excited about. We have the Mr. Perfect tier with the cloth towel. He's got the IC Championship. Really good-looking Mr. Perfect figure in the yellow. We also have our Greg the Hammer Valentine. Got the new leg mold in there. Those thick boys right there. Look at that guy right there. Looking pretty damn good. Saw those back at WrestleMania. Got the nice white jacket in there. Greg the Hammer Valentine. Not my favorite talent of all time, but still certainly a cool figure. And we found the full set. Not only did we get the regular edition, but we have the chase. We have the regular edition Ted DiBiase in the green suit, which is a beautiful looking figure. Uh, you get old man Ted and young man Ted or younger man Ted in the green, which is a great looking figure, and then you know you had to cop the white suit, man. So excited to, to find the chase here along with the regular version. Usually, you know, you're finding a bunch of chases or you're finding the regular. In this case, we actually found both. So he's got the white and gold in there. You guys know I love white, so this looks very, very clean. We have our white suit, DiBiase, and he does have his black shoes in there. So million dollar title looks good. All these figures look really damn good, man. So that was our full haul. We got the full legend set there. We also got our uh, our Chase D-Lo here for Patreon. We have our Triple H figure to complete it. We have the greatest hit, Shawn Michaels. We have our Target exclusive, Adam Cole. And we have our Target exclusive or whatever Black Widow figure, which looks really good. You combine all of these hulls here with all of these hulls here and then all the other hulls that we got going on, man. It has been crazy, but that is going to wrap this toy hunt up, man. Thank you guys so very much for watching. A huge shout-out to our patron members of the MDT YouTube channel. Always appreciate those guys. Huge shout-out to those fellas over there. They are the ones that get first dibs on the wall and what it looks like here. So 
see it. So I guess I can post this up to you guys since they already saw it. All right, man, so this is our progress right now. Here is like all the stripes that are done. And then we do have like other stripes that are uh, work in progress. So it's not too, too far. I just got to do the edges of the stripes. But this is kind of what it's going to look like in its entirety when it's done. So you guys can kind of see that there. But yeah, man, that is pretty much going to wrap up the toy hunt. Wanted to show you guys the wall and everything like that, man. So ready to get this wall done. Jesus. Taking forever, man. Taking absolutely forever. But little by little. Nonetheless, I'm getting out of here, man. Thank you for watching. Subscribe to the channel. Follow me on Instagram, Twitter, and TikTok at My Name Toys. I'll see you guys in the next one. Have a blessed one, and I'll catch you later.